we are aware that the conflict is really rooted between two rival gangs. This is another My View TV exclusive. Please remember to hit the notification bell, like, share and subscribe. I don't bring nobody forward in your future for me. Everything where you see up my natural talent. Let me tell you something. You see, when you know what to please the audience with, it's simple me. What well, go on with people? Hope everybody in okay, hope everybody in alright. So we have a lot of things to give thanks for. Let me start right as so I before me continue. When you rise in the morning, give thanks for light, for life, for strength. Give thanks for your food and the joy of living. If you find no reason to give thanks, the fault lies in you. Yeah man, you are the problem. If you now have nothing you got thanks for, you is the problem you understand find something to give thanks for and if you can't find something find somebody give thanks for always remember every day above drug is a blessing you never have to wake up this morning you never know that you never know that but you yet still you don't complain me not tell a lie sometimes i complain to sometimes i ask why jamaica never make good me be honest with you jamaica never make good as they go waterfall the place smash up but this man me know no fan i go complain Yes, like me, me know no fan I come here and say, yo, the road mash up, this and that now work, no water no dead, no light no dead, run with end the blessing and JPS, we know so that it's gonna happen, you understand? But me can tell the people them something, just give thanks, break tonight here this morning. No worry about the little minor stuff them, Love the government and them, the people never fix that, if you're off a lake, find the hardware, go buy some flash pad, can remember more water come, you see what people used to go up on them knee yesterday and I pray? Holy heap of paper the on them near place and they say yo CF80 You understand CF80 can't manage no more Some guys say alright like come here go CF80 Jamaica can't take the kind of water I can put some pound on And you see that? Look a bit of water touch you Yes the place smash up But we don't lose no life Things could have been worse you know No say this man here alone could have wake up and live over 80 Me I tell you the truth but guess what We are here and we are happy You understand it's great Feeling to be alive, but anyway, only part thing go on the news. So, I don't want the people them feel like such a little water drop. I'm not going to tell the people them go on the news. I'll keep on posting on the local water situation later. But it's Monday night, one piece of shouting go on past the Ipen Road, right on the Tintan Park. The people them still want everybody get stopped because they look for some youth where they can't find. And you know, once they start look for youth, you know, them the youth there are some trouble make a car. Everybody in every community know all of the youth make it trouble. But I tell the people them go on the news and later we go up on the stand thing because some holy party thing go on. I know the news is not come to tell the liar and make up the story. Them normally say Portland is known for the prettiest set of beach and prettiest set of river. Say so what I said, that the people them say. I don't know if they mean it. But let me tell you something we are sure about. Criminal attack over Portland. Holy, holy, holy these days. And because it's a criminal attack over Portland, right now Portland may start. Right now. The police on Monday has charged a Portland businessman with fraud and conversation after allegedly failed to leave a motor's vehicle in a transaction. Thief! Yes, them wall of thief people. The man has been identified as 36-year-old Donovan Thompson, otherwise called Free, of a Norwich Hill address. Yes, everybody's supposed to know Free. Yeah, man, everybody know him from about them side. The man don't know him, capable of man. I don't know him, I do it a long time. The police said between April 2020 and May 2021, the complaint and paid Thompson approximately... 3150000 in order for him to purchase two motor vehicles. After not receiving them at the agreed time, the complain and demand the car or his money back. Yes, people, the man said, give me my money. Since you text so long for giving me the car, give me back the money. However, neither was forthcoming. And the complainer reported the matter to the fraud squad. But come like, you didn't know, so boy, you're a fraud, a long time. You must need know. Thompson later surrendered to the detective and was subsequently charged. But lad, he have the money? He have the money? If you know the money, let him out. Let him out from bail. Because the man not give back for him money. I tell you the truth. I'm just going to lock him up. Yes, I can tell you something. If the man not give back him any money, find a way to let him out. I make the complain and angle him, bangle himself. Because yes, I never tell you. Who are the numbers? I'm going to pay him. Because I'm only putting him on the other day. I wonder if FLA get what they going to do. They take around at the time. But anyway. That are different news. A Kingston teenager has been charged with wounding in intent, shooting with intent and illegal possession of firearm and ammunition following an incident along Logos Drive Painland in Kingston 11 on Tuesday, May 11. So, remember, refresh your memory upon that incident that coming know a lot of you know where the happened and where it takes place. 
Anyway, the police said the complainant were standing along the roadway in the community at about 11.05 p.m. when a teen who was among a group of men allegedly pounced upon them and opened gunfire. Two persons received gunshot injuries. Yes, people, them not dead still. Them just get whole heap of binds up. And Uno at them is a Uno big fool police. Go look, just go look for this boy and carry me in. Following an investigation, the teen was arrested and subsequently charged. His identity is being with L because he's under the age of 18. Where my man in Pupanium? Yes. Well, not the parents them name. I said that I said that I mean that I said that I'm not take you back. Who don't know for control look of picnic since who don't know for control them and who know where to start blame. Call out them name. You understand me? The family and the people them who them shoot off are the same people them. Go fix for them business because I'm not Mr. One that care behind bars. I see the mama and papa them off till I go carry food around the game and fill with taxpayers dollar and waste for them. Them a little boy to get slapped with. I can carry them parents with them too. I said what I said and I mean what I said and I mean I take you back. So who want vex? Vex. No fun enough for control little germs them on have. Me I be honest enough people, me talk it as it is. Them don't know for control the germs when they have. And them germs that come on road I be a menace to society. So we need to get rid of all of them. Both them and them parents. I make this world a better place. I'm tired of them now. Incarcerated dancehall veteran, hold on, me not talking zebra and cartel, me talking ninja man now. Mourning the loss of one of his son, Jamar Ballantyne, who was murdered along Olympic Way in St. Andrew on Sunday. Remember, ninja, this is only a ninja killer ninja. I want to defend ninja, them can't tell ninja who slap with his son. We are grieving, but we are holding on. He was 31, he had a daughter who is only two years old, so hold on, they never know, say, I'm going to young for time, I'm here, and them thing there. So she had to grow up without her daddy. Ninja man has been made aware of the incident and is holding it like only a real father can. Kimmy done, Ninja man needs her. That she has to be one land there, Kimmy. Remember, so he never really grew that father either, you know. You've got some ninja the inner outer prison who all of them time when he might grow up. So anyway, it just a continue. It's a family trend. According to the report from the police corporate communication unit, you know, Ballantyne, also called Roy R. Ratty of Lower Mall Road address, was killed by unknown assailant at about 8.45 a.m. The reports that explosion were heard by residents who summoned the police. On their arrival, Ballantyne was seen with multiple gunshot wound. He was assisted to the hospital by residents where he was pronounced dead on arrival. A dead man named for Pankyarish thing. Dead man named for Pankyarish thing. Time to tell you now. Make the people them come come pronounce them right there and stop waste time carrying the hospital about to not pronounce them. I mean, I want nobody write in the comment section, but the doctor alone can pronounce them. Walk with the doctor up on the road then. You understand that that's all me I say. Who know me I read all the news from other country? Me tell them to them pronounce them on this spot then. Who know lift up dead body about to not carry them. I'm a tough up, I can continue. Ninja man whose real name is Desmond Ballantyne is serving a life sentence for the 2009 murder of Ricardo Ricky Chupa Johnson. He must serve at least 25 years in prison before he's eligible for a release or on parole. His son, Janil, and co convict Dennis Clayton will each serve 15 years behind bar before being eligible for parole. Well, and they're not going to parole. I slap on the slap them around them, I'll be honest with you. But then again, people, remember my times I cry for violence, that I don't know, because you feel like, say, you can do people things, and people, people don't do uno back things. And I know, people, I want you to take out to the pen and a piece of paper and write down this equation here. Yeah. Record a Ricky Trooper Johnson, where them said they murdered in 2009, and where him come from? Around the mall road. Which part Ninja Man's son come from? The mall road. So when you think it that got him? You understand? They never take a purge while it's hot. They wait until it's cool and nobody remember about it. I said what I said and I saw me look at it. Tell the police them the information when I tell you. And no. tell me if I'm not say, yo, you know, say I could let you. And maybe the family come back from Zap and Ninja Man Pitney because them lose one. But anyway, we we'll just continue to keep it between owner and loan. And the Clayton family, nobody else to have to be involved. It's just between the Balling Time, the Jans, and the Clayton family from Marwood. All zone need to go. So what I said, I mean what I said, and I not take it back. Anyway, what take a walk go past Tony Superintendent Fletcher. I give one little update from little gang violence who are going up there from the other day. Your man and the man talk to you. So I want the people them listen. We are aware that the conflict is really rooted between two rival gangs, the Brooks Level and the Erie Castle Road gangs. We know that the, the triple murder that was committed on the Wednesday a couple of weeks ago or a week ago was a definite it was definitely related to it was a reprisal a direct reprisal for the killing of one man on monday the second in in, in stony hill the operatives they have been elusive we are aware of some of them 
We are also aware that the citizens are aware of who the players are. And so we're relying on the citizens to assist the police by whatever means in bringing these criminal operatives mm -hmm. under control, causing them to account for their actions because should they fail, mm -hmm. somewhere down the road, the crime is going to find its way to, to someone's doorstep who at that time is going to regret not having done something to bring about an end to the situation. Me not really have no holy for thing for say about this. Cause remember, me normally tell the people to come out, come ball when they touch for them doorstep. But always remember, if you have ears to ear, use them. You understand? Superintendent Fetcher don't attack to nobody. Anyway, people, tell a friend, tell another friend, come, come check us out.